there was a huge ball of fire, the car was in flames. She was relentless, she was fearless, she was very bold in what she did. So she was loved and hated in equal measure. She was one person who really put all politicians on the spot, including myself. And that's how it should be in a democracy. Two hundred meters right in front of me, there was a huge ball of fire, the car was in flames. When I arrived on the scene, it was like a war zone. The person on board this boat sent a message to his wife, asking her to open a bottle of wine because they needed to um, celebrate. They could have done a million other things, but they chose a car bomb. They wanted to show that they acted with impunity, that they just can't be stopped. There were people who had an interest in silencing Daphne. We are saying, who is the mastermind? This is what we want to know. You know, we want to hold the investigation to account. So is this a, an investigation that's really going after the people who ordered the killing? The killing of Daphne is not only a Maltese story, it's a European story. We're all at risk now because of what happened to Daphne. And I don't just mean journalists, actually. I mean anyone who stands up to power. We have to respond.